I've been reworking my wiring for the solar panel and my charging system here in the off-grid trailer. Right now it's night time, so of course there's no current coming in. I have my constant battery voltage showing here now. Got my new amp meter in the mail. I haven't hooked it up yet. And that'll eventually replace this amp meter. Now I've just essentially doubled my charging current coming from the solar panels by taking this heavy gauge wire. This is some wire that originally ran into the trailer. This was the this thick wire was the original camping wire where you would plug in at a campground. And this is some heavy, heavy gauge wire. The green I didn't use. But as you can see, I've run the wires up. This comes from the solar panel through the meter. And then I've used heavier gauge wire coming out of the meter and going to my charge controller. There's a relay here. The only thing exposed, I've hidden all the wires very well now. The only thing exposed is my homemade solar charge controller because I'm always tweaking and adjusting the settings on this, the voltage and everything. So that stays open. I have my LEDs. I still have to build a case for this eventually. But these are the LEDs that show the status. This one shows it's charging. This one shows it's charged. And this is actually a, um, a dump system. So once the batteries are charged, the relay will flip and send the energy off to another set of batteries or something else. And then I have some heavy duty bolts here, my plus and minus. These are my terminal connections. Let's see if I can get some light in here. Those are my main plus and minus terminals for everything. And then I ran another big heavy gauge cable out directly to the batteries. This goes outside all the way down, runs through outside. Eventually I'm going to have to drill a hole through here and mount these properly. But for now, I have some heavy, heavy gauge wires and I've literally doubled my, my output, my capability. So the wires were causing too much resistance and it seriously limited my, my charging current. So I had this going today. The wire coming from the solar panels was running all day and I was pumping 9 amps and if you watch my previous videos I was only getting 4.5 amps sometimes 5. Now I was pushing 9 amps today 5 when the clouds came over which is amazing and previously I got zero current when the clouds came over so that's nice. Now today I've installed this wire going straight to the battery. I had some uh, finer wire like this little one here and I've replaced everything tonight um, sadly, I have to go to work tomorrow, so I won't but get to see the results until next weekend. But I'm quite sure that it will have a huge impact on my charging current.